Hey guys, this is Mr. Stylizing here bringing you my third map review and today we have Impaler SX built by the Australian legend of the Outlaw Racing League, no other than the racer himself, x Reigns. This map is evidently a Supercross map and a real nice one at that. The gate is 20 seconds so it isn't too overly long, which no sexual pun intended. It features a quick switch between terrain and SX right at the start, and the first berm is rarely used because it makes you lose some time as it is simple to cut straight through the middle and keep your speed. The loop section is very deadly for most drivers as when you take the turn it can flip you onto your head easily and with the first split section it does take a lot out of a racer, but if you hit it right, so you can really do it pretty well. Like all Supercross tracks you must either have extreme luck or some great racing skill behind you to get through that section cleanly. The second split section features a window coliseum and it works really well but for me it's off-putting when I race. The wall coliseum berm, for me it is something unique and rarely seen and it is forged very well which is really smooth and good fun to drive on. And with the following jump if you take the berm wrong can lead you to a disaster landing and mess up with your race pretty badly but again that is based on driver error. The final section of the track with the whoops for me it is a real letdown in comparison to the rest of the track as there seems to be no way to take it without losing speed or flipping out any mongoose, which can lead to taking the final jump really disastrously. And on to the ratings. The aesthetics are a 9 out of 10. The whole track seems to be split up well and every section of the track seems to have something to look at which in my opinion is awesome as most forges skip over through the aesthetics or just don't bother with them at all and with the aesthetics can make a map seem more professionally done. Flow is a 9 out of 10, this track is amazing and everything fits together nicely and when you hit a perfect lap nothing seems to go wrong, besides that final whoop section which could be improved. Originality is an 8 out of 10, this open style supercross track is seen a lot of times but built into this area of Forge World isn't seen very often, especially when it's been built so well that it looks actually a part of the area, which when finding that that is a unique feature is rare among tracks. The aesthetics are seen a lot in the supercross map to give a stadium appeal but nonetheless are very nicely done. To submit a map for the next episode of Stylizing Reviews, send an email to fpl.maps at hotmail.com. Review anything and everything, so get sending guys. This is Mr. Stylizing, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys later. Checkpoint re